So in this video I'll show you how to use, how, sorry, how to remove a snap ring uh, using a multimeter, believe it or not. <laughs> so this is pretty much a continuation of the uh, master cylinder repair video, or replacement on the Rambler. I'm not sure what it's going to be yet, probably a replacement. Just replace the whole thing because I have another one. Slightly different though, but you know, we'll get to that in later on. But the snap ring, um, the holes, I have a snap ring removal tool. Uh, this is sort of what it looks like. This is one for outer snap rings. Um, so when I press on it, it, the, uh, it opens apart. The other one, it's the inverse of this. For inner snap rings, you want it to close. So when you press this, it would actually close instead of open. So this is a normal closed. The other one is a normal open. Uh, anyways, but even, like, you can still use this. You just do the reverse movement. So my plan was to put this in there. Then with both hands, press it out like that. Or rather, press it in, sorry. So it would be like that. Go in like that, and then go like that. But the holes are too small. The holes on this snap ring are too small. So I went ahead and I got myself the multimeter and used the, the uh, uh, what do you call it, the uh, probes. And I just pressed them together and you don't have to, it's, it snapped right out. Uh, it's fairly easy because it, um, uh, the, the spring is pushing it outwards, right? So, anyways, I thought that would be interesting. So you could, I could have used a paper clip uh, as well. Uh, sorry, not a paper clip, rather a, a paper clamp, clamp for paper. So that's what I'm. So you could also use this. So you remove that, like that, you remove that one, and. It will fit in. Let's see. It's still a bit too big, actually. So yeah, you might have had to, you know, sharpen these up, point them, or you know, you just have to be creative. Like I say, you know, like I always say, you know, greatest, the best mechanic is the one that's most creative. So maybe a smaller paper clamp would have done it. But it is, it is very small. Those little holes are tiny. I yeah, hope this helps.